Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy Mikey here, um, aka Ants Canada. Um, and uh, I know some of you guys have been asking why I haven't uploaded any videos lately, um, and it's because uh, it's fall here in Toronto, and uh, like in all temperate regions, it gets cold around this time of the year. Well, in this hemisphere, anyway. Um, and the ants go into hibernation, so. There isn't much action for ant keepers around this time unless you have like Matetramorium colony, which I have now, and they're still going as if it's still summer. So, um, I just wanted to show you guys how I hibernate my ants. Um, so, I, if you look around, this is just kind of like a, a storage in the basement, um, and uh, you know, it's relatively cold here, it's actually kind of chilly now, um, and there's no heating here. Uh, you know, but it's not exactly outside, you know, so um, you don't want to put your ants outside because, well, they'll die. Um, ants burrow in the ground when they hibernate and they can stay uh, a few degrees above the ambient temperature outside during the winter. Um, and so I, I keep mine here. A garage will do, um, or an attic or something. But anyway, uh, let you have a look here. They remain here probably till, mm, I'd say March. Um, all my ants are here. You see, do not touch fragile glass test tubes. Sleeping ants, this side up. Um, and I've got a couple species of ants here that are all hibernating. This here is a. Oh, this is a Ponera. Caught that in the summer. Actually, that was uh, that's that's the ant that was uh, in my last video. Um, this here is a Laceus neoniger, um, and they're all very very lethargic here. Um, I've added a drop of honey for them to you know to drink if they want. Here's a parasitic Laceus, and let's see, got several species here. This here is a uh, Laceus, um, either Neoniger or Alienus. Um, I believe I have a. What's this? This is a parasitic Laceus who is hibernating as well. Um, I'm going. If any of the um, Laceus non-parasitic species that I have here, if any of them have a colony then uh, I'll probably try to introduce um, the parasitic Laceus to that colony so I can have a parasitic Laceus colony. This is a Myrmica. So anyways, so that's what I do. They're all here, they're all cold. Um, I check them every now and then, you know, uh, to make sure they're okay. Make sure mold isn't taking over, um, and to you know, add a drop of honey every month or so. It's, a, it's another parasitic glacius. Yeah. This here is a glacius neoniger. All right, so that there is how I hibernate my ants. Thanks guys.